almost, not quite, but equally uh, as good at home. Be an interesting game tonight between uh, the Orleans Saints and the Atlanta Falcons because if things hold the form and they never do, but you'd think Falcons, Patriots, because they're both yeah. at home. But what are you most interested in that game tonight? What are you looking to find out about both teams in this game? Tonight is fascinating. And I went back this week and I studied their last three on film. Um, and the Falcons still have not stopped the Saints on offense. And everybody's going to say, wait a second, you know, they, they won one of them and they kept one close last year. Well, if you look at how the Saint, the Falcons have stopped the Saints, it's been the Saints stopping the Saints. Go to the first matchup this year, Brees throws two uncharacteristic interceptions, one really kind of a fluke underhand deal. He's trying to throw the ball away. Ivory fumbles on a conversion run. Um, Devery Henderson in the fourth quarter, nine minutes left, has a wide open ball down the sidelines, an absolute dime by Breeze. It's going to put the Saints up. It's going to be a no-brainer. Just drops it right through his hands. And then Garrett Hartley misses a 29-yard field goal. So... Uh, basically everything that could have happened well for the Falcons did. Um, I think the Saints are a better football team. I'm getting ripped for saying it. People are saying, how can you say that? I think the Saints go into Atlanta tonight and give them a beatdown and then go back there in a couple weeks and do it again. I, I think the Saints are the team that can kind of take that mojo away from the Falcons. I think they're a better team. They love the matchup. Drew Brees in his last three matchups is thrown for 77% against the Falcons, 323 yards a game. They run the ball. They can do anything they want. If they don't beat themselves, if the Saints can just go out there and not have, not implode, not have those self-inflicted wounds, I think not only do they win, I think they win easily. Uh, real quickly, we saw our fourth coaching change in the middle of the season. Fuck you, Trudeau.